Standard blade tensioner guides come on all bandsaws. They're not really all that accurate. What you're trying to achieve with the bandsaw is the right tension on the blade so that the blade doesn't flex backwards too far. Blade tension, a lot of people test it by moving the blade back and forth like this. That's not your concern. Blade tension is how much the blade is going to flex this way. You can see I'm using a Carter stabilizer here. If you tighten that blade up so that the pressure you're exerting on the front here, the speed rate is not going to flex this blade back too far, that's all that's required. A lot of these cast iron saws, if you tighten the blade too much, you can actually flex the frame of the saw. You don't need to run the blades that super tight. You just have to be concerned with your feed rate that you're not going to push that blade too far out of position. Moving your blade back and forth like this really doesn't prove anything. All it does is show that the blade moves back and forth like this. The concern with any bandsaw is how far it pushes this way.